Yeah, welcome back to Woodruff Grove. Uh, earlier today, I came out and checked my flax that was redding in my pond and found that there were lots and lots of fibers coming off the stalks. And what it was like when I was pulling it out was almost like spider webs kind of coming off. So it is easily possible that it was over redded, but I can't say. Uh, mostly it was from the stuff on the top, not necessarily all on the bottom. Um, it had the highest heat. So anyway, I pulled it out. And as you can see, we're just going to kind of pan around a little bit. Got my stuff out here on the ground. Out drying. I just pulled it out, laid it out, rinsed it off with some fresh water, and then put it out on the ground. So what I, what I want to do is I want to get a couple stalks that might still be wet or damp, and uh, show you the fibers pulling off. So I'm going to get the camera down close and in a uh, macro mode. But first, I want to show you what the pond looks like. Pick the camera up and we're going to walk on over to the pond. Refocus down at the pond. Just kind of this. looking water kind of get a focus on that well that's what the water looks like after we're done redding so it's probably got a lot of good bacteria in it and lots of good stuff in it and stuff from the plants and um, nutrients from the plants so this is going to be what you would call garden tea and so I'm going to take this water and I'm going to water my garden with it because I still have plants that need to be watered like tomatoes and things like that so we're going to go ahead and do that with this water so we're not going to waste the water or the nutrients in the water so let me stop this and let's get a close look at what the fibers look like close up. Okay, so here's some flax fiber close up. You can see the really fine fibers coming off. See all that. So all that's fine fiber from the flax plant. Um, not super long pieces here, but um, definitely uh, what we're looking for. So the reading process has worked. We're going to let everything dry and then we're going to crunch this stuff up and we're going to get the fiber out of it and uh, hopefully uh, it will be very usable. And so that's my next step. One more step in the process. Talk to you all later. You can see the fibers, the fine fibers here. Just pulling off, pulling off the outside part of the plant, and uh, some pretty fine stuff here. So we'll see how this all works out. Here you go. Talk to you all later. Bye.